holy, holy Lord God of hosts. Heaven and earth are full of your glory. Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Hosanna in the highest. In the name of the Father, <clears throat> and of the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. O oh, my Jesus, I direct my mind, take possession of my whole being, and close me in the depths of your heart. Protect me against the assaults of the enemy. My only hope is in you. And I return to the Blessed Mother, O oh, Mary, my Mother, and my Lady. I offer you my soul, my body, my life, my death, all that will follow it. I place everything in your hands, O oh, my Mother. Cover my soul with your virginal mantle. Attain for me the grace of purity of heart, soul, and body. Defend me with your power against all my enemies. Amen. Lord Jesus Christ, loving Savior, I come before you in this hour of prayer just as I am. I'm sorry for my sins. I repent of my sins. Please forgive me. In your name, I forgive all others for what they've done against me. I renounce Satan, the evil spirits, and all their works. I give you my entire self, Lord Jesus, down and forever. I invite you into my life, Lord Jesus. I accept you as my Lord, God, and Savior. Heal me. Change me. Strengthen me in body, soul, and spirit. Come, Lord Jesus. Cover me with your precious blood. And fill me with your Holy Spirit. I love you, Lord Jesus. I praise you, Jesus. I thank you, Jesus. I shall follow you every day of my life. O Mary, my mother, Queen of Peace, all the angels' saints, please help me. Amen. I'm going to pray prayer number five for our spiritual protection prayer tonight. Prayer number five in the Rosary Family Prayer Book. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Most gracious Virgin Mary, Thou who would crush the head of the serpent, protect us from the vengeance of the evil one. We offer you in this holy hour our prayers, our supplications, and sufferings, our good works to you, so you may purify them, sanctify them, and present them to your Son as a perfect offering. May this offering be given to any demons that influence us, that they may not know the source of the expulsion and blindness. Blind them, that they know not our good works. Blind them, so they know not in whom to take vengeance. Blind them. So they may receive the just sentence for cover us with the precious blood of your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, so we may enjoy the protection that flows from the passion of death. We ask this for the same Christ, our Lord. Amen. Brothers and sisters, I invite you to spiritually place yourselves before our Lord in the most blessed sacrament of the altar, the source, center, and summit of our Catholic faith is our Eucharistic Lord. So spiritually place yourselves here with all the angels and saints who are adoring the Lord 24-7. My God, I believe, I adore, I hope, and I love you. And I beg pardon for those who do not believe, who do not adore, who do not hope, and do not love you. Lord Jesus Christ, I cannot now receive you sacramentally. Come, I pray, at least spiritually in your heart. As though thou hast already come, I embrace thee, and unite myself entirely to thee. Never permit me to be separate from thee again. O oh, come, Lord Jesus, come into my heart. My adorable Jesus, may our feet journey together. May our hands gather in unity. May our hearts beat in unison. May our souls be in harmony. May our thoughts be as one. May our ears listen to the silence together. May our glances profoundly penetrate each other. May our lips pray together to gain mercy from the Eternal Father. O oh, Blessed Lady, spread the effect of grace of thy flame of love over all humanity. Amen. O oh, come, Holy Spirit. Come by means of the power of intercession of the Immaculate Heart of Mary, your well-beloved spouse, that we may pray with devotion, attention, and reverence, that we may pray from our hearts. Amen. 
Loving Savior, we come together to adore you as one true holy God. We come with contrition to make reparation for all of our sins. But we come in thanksgiving for the countless gifts, graces, blessings, God moments bestowed upon us each and every day. And Lord, we come with many prayers of supplication, confident and mindful of your words. Ask, and you shall receive. Seek, and you shall find. Knock, and it shall be opened unto you. So we pray for all the intentions from our three o'clock hour divine mercy today. All the intentions are the nap on the Rosary Family Prayer List. I received the new list. I, I love the new improved list. It's, it's, it's perfect. It's easier for me to read and to get a grasp of. And we pray, Lord Jesus, for all the people providentially we came in contact with this day. Lord, we thank you for all the time we spent in prayer today. Lord, we pray for all the sick and suffering, especially those battling chronic illnesses, those battling uh, non-Hopkins lymphoma, those battling migraine, headaches, stomach issues, those recovering from surgeries, preparing for surgeries. We pray for Natalie, Celia, and all those who are battling cancer or whatever form is taken. We pray, Lord Jesus, for Sonia. We're praying for her daughter, Carmen. We can help me grant her the grace that she needs. Don, we're praying for Vince and Mariah, that they would come back uh, to the practice of the faith. Chuck, we're praying for Father Charles Montgomery, who uh, passed away in February at the age of 50, uh, at the age of 97, and he rests in peace. We pray for Matt and Cecilia, their upcoming uh, wedding. We pray for all those who are looking for work. I think about Greg, especially William. Amy, we're praying for um, Jose uh, in um, Duncan Hills, uh, California. Pray for Jose that, uh, for the grace that he needs. We're praying for um, your daughter, sister Maria Consolata. May God bless her in her beautiful, beautiful vocation as a bride of Christ. Uh, praying, uh, Jackie, for you and your husband, Nate, uh, for your healing in mind, body, spirit. We pray for your sons, Andrew and Kyle, that they return to the practice of the faith. We pray for all the children, grandchildren, nieces, nephews, siblings of our Rosary family who are away from the faith, that they would come back to the practice of the faith. Oh, Mary, and as we celebrate this the Feast of Annunciation, we humbly ask your powerful, gracious intercession for all of our petitions. We pray, Vicki, for Ed Goody, for the graces he's in need of. Praying Ann Walls for you and Ruby and all those praying silently with us. Praying, uh, Margaret Rash, God bless you, upon you. Alice, praying for you and our friends in Japan. Praying for Patricia, our friend up in Canada. Praying for my dad, Ed Goody, and all those suffering from cancer and all those suffering mind, body, spirit. Amen. Praying, loving Savior, for Lily's good results. Oh, and Thanksgiving, for Lily's good uh, results. So, thank you, Jane. Praying for Andrew Michael's home close to home that he may attend Sunday Mass regularly. Praying for Bishop Strickland and all my brother priests who are on the sidelines. Conversion of children, daughter. Okay, Eileen, see your petition here. Sandy, praying for you know, Anika, uh, for John, search. Oh, St. Joseph. St. Joseph, the work that so many people looking for work. Please intercede for all those connected with the Rosary family to find uh, work to support the families. Praying for Elizabeth Kale's husband, uh, to get that raise that she's been asking. And gratitude for Ryan Jr.'s good results of his can, uh, CT scan. Thank you, Patty. Praying, whoop, let's see here. One more. Praying for Brian Sr. to have a good result of his procedure tomorrow morning. May the angels go before Brian to prepare the way. Praying Dolores for Sarah Lee, Roro, Garrett, and Tommy for the graces that our lady sees are most in need of. Praying for my daughter Dasha's mother in law, Kathy, at home in hospice. Oh, St. Joseph, please intercede. Praying for all those who recently passed away. I think about Mary Griffith's uh, father passed away suddenly on uh, Easter uh, Sunday. And for all these petitions here, bless Father, give them all to your immaculate heart. Amen. So let's see here. My daughter Maria and the two sons. My son William to move, move to a faith-based area for the healing of Emily and Vanessa and all in need. We'll be praying, obviously, to joy for the Mistress Rosary uh, tonight. In the name of the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, Amen. I believe in God, the Father, my Creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord, <clears throat> who was conceived of the power of the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under the Pontius Pilate, 
was crucified, died, was buried. He descended into hell, and the third day rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, and is seated at the right hand of God the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Catholic Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, the life everlasting. Amen. For Holy Father, the increase of faith, hope, charity, our Father, heart in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace. <clears throat> the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. I believe in God, the Father Almighty. Creator of heaven and earth. Oh, oh, sorry. Sorry, folks. I get mixed up with the uh, chapel of thy mercy. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. All glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now and ever shall be, well without end. Amen. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine, all praise and all thanksgiving be every moment thine. The first joyful mystery, the Annunciation, with the Church celebrates today, the angel Gabriel, the archangel Gabriel declares unto Mary, she conceives by the power of the Holy Spirit. We offer you, O Lord Jesus, this decade in honor of thy incarnation, and we humbly ask of thee, through this mystery, that through the intercession of thy loving Holy Mother, the gift of profound humility, may the grace of the Incarnation and the Annunciation come down into our souls to make us truly humble. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and down at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now, and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary. Full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. <coughs> Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, <coughs> the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in the now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in the now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit as it was in the beginning, as now and ever shall be, well without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need of thy mercy. The second joyful mystery is the visitation. Chrissy praying for relief of knee pain and for your intentions, praying for Jack. Elizabeth Cerna praying for Terry, Vicky, Zena, Lisa, Peter, Devon, Nita and the couples who are trying to conceive. 
I pray for Garrett that he and his wife may be blessed with a child. Praying a loving Savior for Irene, praying for you and all those praying silently with us. Scrolling through some of the petitions here. Oh, blessed Mother, we give all these petitions to you. Prayers for Rosemary Perez is having her immunotherapy tomorrow. Uh, may it work very well for her. Praying Jane Mayer for a mother of five children. Her husband died a year ago. She continues to struggle with his loss. I also want to pray for Tony Vaughn, who had the, the burial of her uh, son Jason several days ago. So for all those who have recently lost loved ones, God may give grace of consolation, healing, peace, and courage to keep pushing forward with their pilgrimage of life for what God has in store for them to accomplish. Praying for Luke has the stomach flu, Kathy and the flu, oh, and Caitlin with a sore throat and cough or husband's eye infection. So Arlene praying for all the petitions here. Arlene Lambert praying for a friend who's having a biopsy on Friday. Oh, blessed mother, please visit all these people for whom we're praying. For we offer you, Lord Jesus, this decade in honor of the visitation of thy holy mother to her cousin, St. Elizabeth. We humbly ask of thee, through this mystery, and through Mary's loving intercession, the gift of perfect charity towards your neighbor. May the grace of the mystery of the visitation come down into our souls to make us really charitable. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, <clears throat> full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, <clears throat> now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sin, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who must be at the mercy. The third joyful mystery is the nativity. We offer, we offer thee, O child Jesus, this third decade in honor of thy blessed nativity, and we humbly ask of thee, through this mystery, and through the intercession of thy loving blessed mother, a greater detachment from things of the world, a greater love of poverty, May the grace, the mystery, the nativity come down into our souls to make us truly poor in spirit. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit <coughs> of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. <clears throat> and blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need thy mercy. The fourth joyful mystery, the presentation of the infant Jesus in the temple. We're praying for uh, Rosemary Perez for our immunotherapy. Lico had that one already, help shrink his four liver tumors. Pray for no side, uh, adverse side effects. Margaret Rash, pray for your husband who celebrated a birthday today. So uh, happy birthday to Mr. Rash. Praying for Philip, for you and all of our friends in the Philippines, especially your, your, your family. Praying for the conversions of Brianna, Simon, Luke, and Guillermo. Pray, Lord Jesus, for, let's see here, for Father, I don't know him, but Father Charles Garrity, uh, who passed away just recently, turn rest ground and follow Garrity. Gar Gar Let perpetual light shine upon him. Let for all a deceased priest. Asking St. Joseph to intercede for him. Almighty God, touch the hearts of my sons Kevin and Andre, that they may return to Catholic faith. Amen. Alrighty. So Elizabeth Cal, welcome to welcome to, uh, to here. Alright. We offer you, Lord Jesus, this fourth decade in honor of thy presentation in the temple by the hands of Mary. We humbly ask of thee through this mystery and through the intercession of thy loving blessed mother, the gift of wisdom and the gift of purity of heart and body. May the grace of the mystery of the uh, presentation and purification come down into our souls to make us really wise and really pure. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. This is day our daily bread. Forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil. <clears throat> Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us and down at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. 
Hail Mary, full of grace, Lord with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Hail Mary, <clears throat> full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O my Jesus, forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who most need thy mercy. The fifth the joyful mystery. The finding of the child Jesus in the temple. We'll be praying this decade in Latin. We offer thee, O Lord Jesus, this fifth decade in honor of thy finding the temple among the Lord and men by Our Lady, after she had lost thee. We humbly ask of thee, through this mystery, and through the intercession of thy loving, blessed Mother, to convert us and help us amend our lives, also to convert all sinners, heretics, Hispanic, idolaters, all the way, all those away from the sacrament. May the grace of the mystery of the finding of the child Jesus' temple come down into our souls to truly convert us. Pater Nocter, Quies in Chile, Sancti Pitcher Nomen Tum, Ardenia Tregnum Tum, Fiat Voluntat Tua, Secret in Cielo et in Terra, Panem Nostrum, Cotidianum, De Dobus Hordiae, Et Tibite Dobus, Debita Nostri, Secret at Nos Tibidibus, Debitorbus Nostris, Et Ne Nos Inducas in Tentationum, Said the Amen. Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus Deco, a benedicta tu mulieribus, a benedictus fructus ventris tu Jesus. Sancta Maria, Mater Dei, or Pernobus Peccatoribus, nunc in etorum mortis nostri. Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus Deco, a benedicta tu mulieribus, a benedictus fructus ventris tu Jesus. <clears throat> Sancta Maria, Mutter Dei, Hora Pernobus Peccatoribus, Nunc in Etora Martis Nostri, Amen. Ave Maria, Gratia Plena, and Dominus Decum, a Benedicta Tumuli Eribus, a Benedictus Fructus Ventris to Jesus. Sancta Maria, Mutter Dei, Hora Pernobus Peccatoribus, Nunc in Etora Martis Nostri, Amen. Ave Maria, Gratia Plena, and Dominus Decum, a Benedicta Tumuli Eribus, a benedictus, fructus ventris to Jesus. Sancta Maria, Mater Dei, or Pernobus Peccatoribus, Nunc in Etorum Martis Nostra, Amen. Ave Maria, Gratia Plena, Dominus Deco, Benedicta Tumulieribus, a benedictus, fructus ventris to Jesus. Sancta Maria, Mater Dei, or Pernobus Peccatoribus, Nunc in Etorum Martis Nostra, Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus Tecum, a benedicta tu mulieribus, a benedictus fructus ventris to Jesus. Sancta Maria, Mater Dei, or Pernobus Peccatoribus, nunc in etorum martis nostri, Amen. <coughs> Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus Tecum, a benedicta tu mulieribus, a benedictus fructus ventris to Jesus. 
Tong Femri, Mutter Day, Or Pelobus Pecatorbus, Luke and the Torah Martis Gloss Shaman. Ave Maria, Gratia Femme, Dominus Decum, A Benedicta Tumulieribus, A Benedictus, Procus Vantris to Jesus. Tong Femri, Mutter Day, Or Pelobus Pecatorbus, Luke and the Torah Martis Gloss Shaman. Ave Maria, Gratia Femme, Dominus Decum, A Benedicta Tumulieribus, a benedictus fruit of vanities to Jesus. Sancta Maria, Mater Dei, or Pernobus Peccatoribus, Nunc in the Torah Mortis Glostra, Amen. Ave Maria, Gratia Femme, Dominus Tecum, a benedicta tumulieribus, a benedictus fruit of vanities to Jesus. Sancta Maria, Mater Dei, or Pernobus Peccatoribus, Nunc in the Torah Mortis Glostra, Amen. Gloria Patri, et Filio, et Spiritu Sancto, Secret Derat and Principia Nunca Semper, as in Sacred Law, Sacred Law, Amen. O oh, me, Jesu, the Mitte Nobis, Debita Nostra, Salva Nos Abigni Inferni, Perdac and Chain Among the Salamis Blessed Terramis, Quae Misericordia to a Max Indignant, Amen. We pray now the Hail Holy Queen, pray in a special way for Richard and his daughter Brittany for the grace they need just to be filled with the Holy Spirit. Hail Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, our life our sweetness, and our hope. To thee do we cry, but banish still to be. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping this valley of tears. Turn then, most gracious advocate, thine eyes of mercy towards us. <clears throat> and after this our exile, show unto us the blessed fruit of thy firm Jesus, O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary. Pray for us, O Holy Mother God, that we may be made worthy of the promised Christ. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, and by his life, death, and resurrection, has purchased for us the rewards of eternal life, grant we beseech thee, that in meditating upon these mysteries of the Most Holy Rosary of the Blessed Virgin Mary, that we may imitate what they contain and obtain what they promise, for the same Christ our Lord. Amen. At the bottom of page 30, with these beads, I bind our Rosary family to Mary's beautiful, immaculate heart. O blessed Virgin Mary, I entrust and I consecrate our rosary family to your loving, immaculate heart. Please intercede on our behalf for all the petitions, for all those in the silence of our heart, for all the petitions on the screen. Amen. Let's turn right away to the Virgin of Guadalupe, praying the nine-month novena that Cardinal Burke is urging Catholics worldwide to pray. O Virgin Mother of God, we fly to your protection and beg your intercession against the darkness of sin which evermore enveloped the world and menaced the church. Your Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, gave you to us as our mother as he died on the cross for our salvation. So too, in 1531, when darkness and sin beset us, he sent you as our Lady Guadalupe and Tepia to lead us to him alone is our life and our salvation. Through your apparitions and tepia, and your abiding presence with us on the miraculous mantle of your messenger, the Tilma St. Juan Diego, millions of souls converted to the faith in your divine Son. Through this novena and our consecration to you, we humbly implore your intercession for our daily conversion life to him and the conversions of millions more who do not yet believe in him in our homes and in our nation. Lead us to him alone when victory over sin and darkness and in the world. Unite our hearts to your immaculate heart so that they may find their true and lasting home in the most sacred heart of Jesus. Ever guide us along the pilgrimage of life to our eternal home with him. So may our hearts, one with yours, always trust in God's promise of salvation and in his never-failing mercy towards all who turn to him with humble and contrite heart. Through this novena, and a consecration to you, O Virgin of Guadalupe. Lead all souls in America and throughout the world to your divine Son, in whose name we pray. Amen. Amen. Now we turn towards Our Lady with a beautiful memorari. I pray a special way for Mary Beth, the healing of her, um, her liver, that the enzyme level, levels be normal. Also praying for a little boy in utero. doesn't have a name yet, but he's got a hole in his heart for the healing of his heart. And for all these petitions, Remember, O oh, most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known, that any who fled to thy protection, implored thy help, 
or sought an intercession, blessed in evening. Inspired by this confidence, I fly unto thee, O virgin, to verses by mother. To thee do I come. Before thee I stand sinful and sorrowful. O mother of the word incarnate, <clears throat> despise not my petition, but in thy mercy hear and answer me. Amen. I'll ask our lady to take our hand. Picture when Jesus was a little child, she took the hand of Jesus and guided him. So Mary, as you guided Jesus, please guide us. Take my hand, O blessed mother. Hold me firmly lest I fall. If I'm nervous while I'm walking, quickly heed my humble call. Guide me over every crossing. Watch me when I'm on the stairs. Let me know you're beside me. Listen to my fervent prayers. Bless my every undertaking and my duties for the day. And when the evening draws upon me, I do not fear to be alone. Oh, once again, blessed mother, take my hand and lead me home. Amen. Now this, uh, being the Feast of Our Lady, let's redo our consecration. There's a beautiful prayer. It's on page 103 or prayer number 138 in the Rosa Family Prayer Book. Oh, Blessed Mother, in this, the Feast of the Annunciation, by which you became the Mother of God, conceiving Jesus by the power of the Holy Spirit. Oh, Blessed Mother, I renew and ratify today in thy hands the vows of my baptism. I renounce forever Satan, his pomps and works, and I give myself entirely to Jesus Christ, with the incarnate wisdom, to carry my cross after him all the days of my life, to be more faithful to him than I've ever been before. In the presence of all the heavenly court, I choose thee this day for my mother and mistress. I deliver and I consecrate to thee as thy slave my body, my soul, my goods, both interior and exterior, and even the value of all my good actions, past, present, and future, leaving to thee the entire and full right of disposing me, and all that belong to without exception, according to thy good pleasure, for the greater glory of God in time and eternity. <coughs> o Mary, conceive without sin. Pray for us who have recourse to thee. Now I'm turning back to page 33. Prayer number 30. O Mary, bless this house where thy name is ever held in benediction. All glory to Mary, ever immaculate, ever virgin, blessed among women, the mother of our Lord Jesus Christ and Queen of Paradise. Amen. Cover this house with a mantle of protection. O Mother of Mercy. Amen. Let's add one other Mary in prayer. This is from St. Aloysius Gonzaga. St. Don Bosco had a big devotion to St. Aloysius. So it's prayer number 31. O Holy Mary, my mistress, into your blessed trust and special custody, and into the grasp of your mercy, I commend my soul and my body this day, and every day, and in the hour of my death. To you I commit all my anxieties and miseries, my life, and the end of my life, that by your most holy intercession, and by your merits, all my actions may be directed and disposed according to your will and that of your Son. Amen, amen. Mary, lead us and guide us. Well, let's do one more. This is number 32. I'd like to pray this in the morning, but we'll pray it here. It's number 32. It's called Prayer of Entrustment to Our Lady. So St. Uh, well, Venerable uh, Father Patrick Payton used to pray this every morning. My Queen and my Mother, I give myself entirely to you and show my devotion to you. I consecrate to you this day my eyes, my ears, my mouth, my heart, my whole being without reserve. Wherefore, good mother, as I am then known, keep me and guard me as I have property and possession. My Queen and my Mother, Remember, I am yours. Keep me and guard me as your property. O Mary, the Immaculate Virgin, offer to the Heavenly Father the precious blood of your Son, Jesus Christ, that by his power a mortal sin may be prevented in the world this day. Amen. Let's turn now to St. Joseph. Oh, St. Joseph, there's so many people that we know and they're looking for employment. Please intercede. St. Joseph, be a spiritual father, protector for our rosy family. You are the terror demons who keep us protected from all demonic attacks, all evil attacks. Oh, St. Joseph, whose protection is so great, so strong, so prompt before the throne of God. I place in all my interests and desires. Oh, St. Joseph, do assist me by your powerful intercession and attain me for divine Son, all spiritual blessings through Jesus Christ, our Lord. 
so that having gazed her below your heavenly power, I may offer my thanksgiving and homage to the most loving of fathers. O oh, Saint Joseph, I never weary contemplating you, and Jesus, the sleep in your arms. I dare not approach while he reposes in your heart. Press him in my name, kiss his binding for me, and ask him to return the kiss while I draw my dying breath. Saint Joseph, patron of departing souls, pray for me. Amen. Let's turn to Saint Padre Peel, Saint Trace, both had a great devotion to our Blessed Mother and Saint Joseph. Alrighty. Oh, Saint Padre Peel, please be a spiritual father <clears throat> to our Rosie family. Help us always to pray, to hope, and to not to worry, but to always trust in Jesus. Help us have a greater love for our Eucharistic Lord, His cross, the Blessed Virgin Mary, and her rosary. O Saint Padre Pio, holy bear the wounds of Christ. Accept us this day as your spiritual sons and daughters, and keep us always in the narrow path to heaven by your intercession. And do thou, O our spiritual Father, stay there at the gates of heaven until all of your spiritual children have entered, including all of us. Amen. I will pray the beautiful prayer to our Saint Therese, the Memorari, number 44. And we'll pray the angels tonight. We also want to invoke Saint Gabriel. So we have the statue here representing the Annunciation. So Saint Gabriel is the first one to pray the Hail Mary, right? So every time we pray the Hail Mary, it brings joy to Mary's heart. It reminds her of the first time she heard, the, heard these words from the angel Gabriel. Remember, O most gracious Saint Therese, your promise of never leaving any request made to you without an answer, and of coming down to earth to do good. Full of confidence in your power with the sacred heart of Jesus, we implore your intercession and our need, and beg of you to obtain the rose we so urgently request, if such be God's holy will. And Trace, help us to practice your little way of joyful, humble, confident trust in the Father's love for us. Amen. Amen. You know, it says in Revelation chapter 5, that the, the saints intercede all of our prayers like incense rising up to heaven to intercede for us. And Revelation 8 is the holy angels, where they take our prayers like incense and bring it up to the throne of God. And so we turn to the angels. St. Michael the Archangel, defend us in battle. Be our protection against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray. And do thou, O Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, cast into hell Satan and all the evil spirits who prowl about the world, seeking them in the souls. Amen. Let's turn now to our own guardian angel. He's at our side 24-7. He's always behold the face of, he's always beholding the face of God. He always interceding, interceding for us. And the more we invoke them, the more we give them permission to work in our lives. Angel of God, my guardian dear, to whom God's love commits to be here. Ever this day or night, be at my side, to light, to guard, to rule and guide. Amen. Now here we turn to St. Gabriel, who's pictured here in the statue with the Blessed Mother. O glorious our game to St. Gabriel, the powerful messenger of God, you announced to Mary the birth of our Savior, and in doing so, you brought hope to the world. We pray that, th that you would intercede for us with God, the Father, through your intercession. May we receive the strength of mind and heart to fulfill our mission here on earth, so that one day, we may praise the Heavenly Father with all the angels and saints in heaven. Amen. Well, this is what I like to do. Oh, I got this, this little prayer card. I wanted to share this with you. I don't want to pray that prayer for a good night's sleep. So several people I know are having difficulty sleeping. And uh, St. Ignatius Little said that's a big cross to him. Okay, this is from St. Teresa of Avila. I'm going to read two parts, both sides of this little prayer card. God alone suffices. Let nothing disturb you. Let nothing frighten you. All things are passing away. God never changes. Patience obtains all things. Whoever has God lacks nothing. God alone suffices. Now listen to this from St. Teresa of Avila. May today there be peace within. May you trust you trust that God has you exactly 
or you are meant to be. May you not forget the infinite possibilities that are born of faith. May you use these gifts that you have received and pass on the love that has been given to you. May you be content knowing you are a child of God. Let this presence settle into your bones and allow your soul the freedom to sing, to dance, to praise, and to love. It is there for each and every one of us. Amen. Oh, hold on. Prayer card, Bob. We, we do have this prayer. A lot of things should be in our Rosary Family Prayer Book. So here's the card. Whoop. One side. I was reading this in the back. I particularly like that it says, uh, May you trust, whoop, God. May you trust that God, trust that God, you are exactly where you're meant to be. I think a little mistake there, but I was written, but amen. So God's divine providence, surrendering to live in divine will. Now let's turn to St. Gertrude. St. Gertrude, please intercede for Rosie family and for all those who are having difficulty sleeping. We pray the prayer that, that you wrote, wrote. This is prayer number 90. Prayer of St. Gertrude for sleeplessness. I beseech thee, O most merciful God, by the most tranquil sweetness with which thou hast reposed from all eternity in the bosom of the Father, by the peaceful abode of nine months in the womb of the Virgin, and by all the holy delights which thou hast enjoyed in souls filled with thy love, to grant me some rest, not for my own satisfaction, but for thy eternal glory, so that the strength of my wearied body may be restored, and I may be able to fulfill my duties. Amen. Now let's surrender everything to Jesus. Oh Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Oh Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Oh Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Oh Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Oh Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Oh Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Oh Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Oh Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Oh Jesus, I surrender myself to you. Take care of everything. Oh Jesus, please help me to truly surrender to you, to let go. And please, Lord, take care of everything in my life, down to the smallest detail. I give it to you. Amen. We turn to the Sacred Heart. We ask our Lord to fill in the gaps. Lord Jesus, fill in the gap between the love I've given others today and the love they needed. Jesus, fill in the gap. Lord, fill in the gap between love I've given family, relatives, friends, neighbors, co-workers, and love they needed. Jesus, fill in the gap. In your mercy, Lord, fill in the gap between the love I received from others today and the love I needed. Jesus, fill in the gap. Lord, fill in the gap between love I received from family, relatives, friends, co-workers, neighbors, and bosses, and the love I needed. Jesus, fill in the gap. But above all, I pray, Lord Jesus, fill in a huge gap between the love I've given the Heavenly Father and the love you should have received from me as child. Jesus, fill in the gap. Fill in all the gaps. Eternal Father, I offer the sacred heart of all of his love, all of his suffering, all of his miracles. First, to expiate all the sins I've committed this day and during all my life. Glory be to the Father, and Son, and Holy Spirit, 
as it was in the beginning, was now and ever shall be, the world without end. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer you the sacred heart of you with all of his love, all of his heaven, all of his parents, the pure Father good I've done poorly this day. Bring all my life. Glory be to the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now and ever shall be, the world without end. Amen. Eternal Father, I offer you the sacred heart of Jesus, with all of his love, all of his suffering, all of his merits, to supply for the good art I've done, that I neglected this day, and during all my life. Glory be to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now, and ever shall be, world without an end. Amen. Well, brothers and sisters, we make a transition here to night prayer. So tonight, it'll be the third night in a row, we're praying Psalm 91. Psalm 91. This is right here for the hymn, because it's, today was the solemnity, right? Mass for the Annunciation. O God, come to my assistance. O Lord, make it help me. The glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. O come, Holy Spirit, beloved of my soul. Holy Spirit, enlighten my mind. Refresh my memory. I would call the mind the gifts, the grace, the blessings of God, moments of the day. pause for a moment. Just think about this day. Lord, we thank you for giving us this new day to praise you for the gift of the sacraments. We thank you, Lord, for every moment spent in prayer today. Every rosary pray. We thank you for this beautiful weather we had here in the Midwest today. We thank you for answered prayers for the people we came in contact with. We thank you for our guardian angel being on our side 24-7 and protecting us from so many dangers and evils that we're not even aware of. Thank you, Lord, for the saints. We thank you for our rosary and the coming together for the daily discipline of prayer. Thank you for all the food we had to eat today, the things we got done on our to-do list. Lord, we praise you and thank you for every breath we've taken, every beating of my heart. Well, come, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, help us to see our sins, our faults, our failings. As I began this day, that I begin it with our Lord Jesus Christ, the morning offering, heroic minute, kiss of the crucifix, unity prayer. That I try to live the day in union with Christ, combining every fully deliberate action with the least, the moment to approve the divine assistance. The people I met today, were they better for having met me? At least pray for them. Were my eyes merciful? Or I try to see the good of my neighbor rather than suspect or judge my parents? Were my ears merciful, compassionate, living, listening, not being indifferent to the pain and the moaning of others? Was my tongue merciful? I should never speak negatively to my neighbor. Were my hands merciful, filled with good deeds, corporal, spiritual? Were my feet merciful, that I overcome my own fatigue to assist my neighbor, to assist someone, act of charity? To try to develop that relationship with guardian angel, my holding on to unforgiveness, resentment, not resentment. Have I given into lukewarmness and just, uh, Put my spiritual life on autopilot and not try to strive to come up higher. Because the Lord's always saying, come up higher, my friend. Did I try to be cheerful in my dealings with others? Did I tell God I love him? How often I make myself the center of attention, either through self-pity, moodiness, anxiety, complaining, critical spirit, and patience. Did I treat others as I like to be treated? Did I practice patience with people and circumstances? Lord, we pray this, confidior, may your precious blood flow over our souls to purify us. And that, that's a, like Venus engine. I confess to Almighty God and to you, my brothers and sisters, I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words and what I've done and what I have failed to do through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask, blessed Mary, of a virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me, the Lord of God. May Almighty God, Merci.
Forgive us our sins, <clears throat> and bring us to life everlasting. Amen. At the Lamb's high feast we sing, praise to our victorious King, who has washed us in the tide, flowing from his wounded side. Praise the Lord whose love divine gives his sacred blood for wine, gives his body for the feast, Christ the victim, Christ the priest. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. He who dwells in the shelter of the Most High and abide in the shade Almighty says, O Lord, my refuge, my stronghold, my God, in whom I trust. It is he who, free from the snare of the fowler, who seeks to destroy you. He will conceal you with his pinions, and under his wings you will find refuge. You will not fear the terror of the night, nor the arrow that flies by day, nor the plague that prowls in darkness, and the scourge that lays waste at noon. A thousand may fall at your side. Ten thousand will fall at your right. You, they will never approach. His faithfulness is buckled and shield. Your eyes have only to look to see all the wicked are repaid. You have said, Lord, my refuge, and made the most high your dwelling. Upon you no evil shall fall. No plague approach where you dwell. For you has he commanded his angels to keep you in all your ways. They shall bear you upon their hand, lest you strike your foot against a stone. On the lion and the viper you will tread, and trample the lion. Since he clings to me in love, I will free him. Protect him, for he knows my name. When I call, I shall answer, I am with you. I will save him distress, and give him glory. With length of life, I will content him. I shall let him see my saving power. Glory be to the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, as now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Alleluia, alleluia, alleluia. They shall see him face to face, and bear his name on their foreheads. The night shall be no more. They will need no light from lamps or sun. For the Lord God shall give them light, and they shall reign forever. Now we pray responsorial, but it's a little bit different for uh, the rest of the Easter season. Into your hands I commend my spirit. Alleluia, alleluia. Into your hands, Lord, I commend my spirit. Alleluia, alleluia. You have redeemed us, Lord God of truth. Alleluia, alleluia. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Into your hands, Lord, I commend my spirit. Alleluia, alleluia. Protect us, Lord, as we stay awake. Watch over us as we sleep. That awake we may keep watch with Christ, and asleep rest in his peace. Alleluia. Lord, now let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you prepared in the sight of your people. A light to reveal your nations and the glory of your people as well. The glory be to the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now and shall be, world without end and on. Protect us, Lord, as we stay awake. Watch over us as we sleep. That awake we may keep watch with Christ, and the sleep rest in his peace. Hallelujah. Lord, we have celebrated today the mystery of the rising of Christ to new life. May we now rest in your peace, safe from all that can harm us, and rise again refreshed and joyful to praise you throughout another day. And we ask this in Christ our Lord. And Lord, we beg you to visit this house, the banish of an all deadly party. May your holy angels dwell here to keep us in peace. May your blessings be upon us always. We ask this through Christ our Lord. And may the all-powerful Lord Grant us a restful night and a peaceful death. Amen. Rajin Acheli, late hare, hallelujah. Qui a meru, qui a kameru is deportare, hallelujah. Resurrexit, secutixit, hallelujah. Ora pro nobis Deum. Alleluia. Gaudi literae virgo Maria. Alleluia. Cui es erexit Dominus Veri. Alleluia. Lord, we give you praise, glory, thanksgiving. 
Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. For the gifts and grace of tomorrow and a thanksgiving for the graces of the last four days. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. The Lord be with you, with your spirit. May the Lord stretch forth his healing hand upon you. May he grant you his deep, abiding peace. May he grant you a refreshful night's sleep. May all of you prayer be granted. May Our Lady wrap your mantle. May the blessing of Almighty God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit descend upon you and remain with you now and forever. Amen. Amen. So good night, and God love you. We are the Rosary family. We pray with each other and for each other. Heaven's our home. We're just passing through, and I pray in Jesus' precious name with merit and intercession that each and every one of us will be in heaven, the kingdom of heaven someday, to praise, sing the praise of God for all eternity. Amen. So, brothers and sisters, thank you for all of your prayers. Thank you for being here. Uh, the daily discipline and prayer is necessary for our sanctification and our salvation, right? So, thank you for all of your prayers, and please be sure to my daily prayers to your rosaries and chaplets, divine office, especially when I offer the holy sacrifice to Mass. When the living God, Jesus Christ, comes down on the altar, body, blood, soul, and divinity. Amen. So, God love you. God willing. See you tomorrow. Bye-bye.